Seniors at St. Lucie West Centennial High School are officially done with class. They Ooh. were the very first to walk across <laughs> the field at Longwood Stadium. Congrats to the grads. Mm -hmm. Our Josie Carbonari shows us how students who spent the past two years in a pandemic are now finally able to celebrate the moment. It's been a long four years for the class of 2022. The pandemic at the forefront, online classes, masks, and other restrictions, a big part of these graduates' academic career. I managed to get through it. I never thought I would get up to this point, to be honest. Students from St. Lucie West Centennial High School and Lincoln Park Academy. I know I earned it. Crossing the stage. Tuesday and accepting their diplomas at Longwood Stadium in Fort Pierce. 3,000 students graduating over the next few days and the first ceremony without restrictions. I'm very proud of him. For 18 year old Aaron Boone, throwing on that cap and gown is a symbol of what he has overcome. He lost his dad last year, so it's been a struggle too. His father's photo hanging by his side. That's why I have him here with me at all times. We're so excited that these students made it through the finish line. Um, you know, it's really a testament to them, their parents, our teachers and staff. Everybody really pulled together um, to get these kids to where they are here today. Reporting from Fort Pierce, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News. And four more high school graduations in St. Lucie County will be held between tomorrow and Thursday. Another round of commencement ceremonies are being held at the South Florida Fairgrounds today. Let's go through the list. Students from Olympic Heights High School walked this morning. Forest Hill High School seniors will follow in about 45 minutes at 1 o'clock. And then 6 this evening, students from Glade Central High will receive their diplomas. An hour later in Martin County, seniors there will cross the stage. Martin County High will hold its ceremony in the school gymnasium. You are asked, a little note here if you're going, park at the baseball and the softball fields. And you could start going into the gym as early as 530.